Hello, if you read the book called Father Seraphim Rose's Life and Works, you might remember how it talks about when Father Seraphim was in the world and known as Eugene, he was influenced by a philosopher by the name of Rene Gunon. Rene taught that a person should follow the traditional form of a religion. My response is, I don't understand why that's not the appeal to tradition fallacy and consensus gentium. Something isn't true because it's traditional. It's not true because a lot of people believe in it. And another thing we need to understand about Rene is that God never said that his view is inspired. God never said that that concept is an inspired concept. Rene was just giving his own personal opinion. I also want to share with you something else about Rene Gunon that a lot of people probably are not aware of. In 1906, he joined an occult group called the Martinist Order, from which he developed his Vedanta perennialism. So he obviously was not a discerning person. My source for my claim that he joined an occult group and um, developed his Vedanta perennialism from it is the book, the Occult Renaissance, Church of Rome, page 524, the footnote. Okay, so anyway, I just wanted to share these things, and I'm going to end the video now.